Yo, what's up, YouTube? We in this bitch. I probably shouldn't cuss in the first 15 seconds. We trying to grow. I right. like the video, subscribe. We trying to grow, build a community. I don't have a name for it yet, but we'll get some, bro. But everyone's asking me, cause I'm like, you know, I'm a savant when it comes to anime. I know everything. <laughs> I have the greatest taste. You'll soon find that out. Uh, <laughs> We on a versus anime main characters. This is gonna be fun, not controversial at all. Let's get into it. So this is the dude off solo leveling, right? I'm not gonna lie. I'm not a fan of isekai type shit. I did watch it though. I watched like four episodes and I got bored. <laughs> And this is a sports anime. I ain't seen that either. <laughs> this was a toss up. I did not like this dude for real though. He was kind of bland, boring. He got he got a little powered up though. He got a little bit more buff, but like, is that it? I'm gonna go with this. this dude. Uh, he looks cool. Not really, but we were doing him. Hinata. I got XP. Man, I don't care. How do I keep going? Oh, I'm retarded. I gotta do this. Alright, skip all that. So we got Lelouch. Who the fuck is this? It's Lelouch by default. Lelouch is goaded. Show was so good. Never seen that. Emma. That's Promise Neverland, ain't it? That was a good anime. They kind of fumbled the bad bag hard on that second season, though. That second season, we don't mention that. Um, just for that, I'm going to have to go this, even though I've never seen it. Oh. I don't know who the fuck that is, but it. <laughs> Yusuke. Crazy. I don't know who the fuck that is either. Jotaro. We're going him. I've seen only the first three seasons of JoJo's. I started watching the fourth one. And I was like, what the fuck's happening? And so I stopped watching it. I'm not going to lie. Oh, and if y'all want me to watch any of these animes, I can react to it. First reaction type shit. I can make some good vids. Sinichi? I don't know who the fuck that is. Boji? Bo Boji? I don't know who the fuck that is. I'm gonna vote him. Gone or Deku? Whoo! This is easy as hell me. <laughs> it's easily Deku. Just kidding, it's gone. I hate Deku, I'm not gonna lie. I stopped watching this show because of Deku. He tried every fucking episode. I could not, I couldn't stand it. Oh, uh, guys. Don't hate me. I've never seen Bleach. Look, I'm going to react to Bleach and I'm going to upload it. I've seen Naruto and I've seen One Piece. I haven't seen Bleach yet. I have to see the big three. I have to. I don't know who the other dude was. He should go wins. I know this to be boxing. I don't know who the fuck he is. But we gotta go with Kira. Classic. Who the fuck are these people, bro? They used to be ad people at this point. Oh, GTO man, of course. That's a good. I I read the manga. Oh, Spike, Spike Spiegel. Who the fuck is this dude? Now Fumi? Nah, Spike. That's that's the easy. Whatever happens, happens. Sinkle, he's cool. Um, don't know who this bitch is. It looked like some stupid ass isekai, but. <laughs> He's cool. He's smart, you know. I liked how he counted. 
Oh, we're going. The, he has the main character hair himself. Oh, yeah, I do not watch these type of animes either. They got school clothes on. Fuck no. She looks bad, though. I like her. Oh, Inma. Tinma, I mean. Easy. Monsters goaded. What the fuck is this? This is not an anime. Why is he drawn like that? Who the fuck is this? Oh, we going Kaneki. That's easy. Way over him. Oh my god. Boruto? I don't know who this is, so I'm about to vote Boruto off default. Even though Boruto started off hateable, I feel like that's, that's the point of him. He starts off hateable, and you gotta grow to love him. He's like the opposite of Naruto. Well, you don't grow to hate Naruto, but you know what I mean. He has everything granted to him, whereas Naruto had nothing. And, you know, that's just his character arc. I just watched Cyberpunk. That shit was so good. I feel like I've seen him before. That cyberpunk shit was so good. David! David! My friend was watching this. He said it was good. But I guarantee you it's not as good as one piece. I was like, I gotta go Luffy. Naruto just wins by default. Don't know who the fuck that was. Slam dunk. We're going to slam dunk, dude, bro. Miyamoto Musashi better be in here. Oh, I haven't seen this part of JoJo's yet. I should react to JoJo's, too. But this was on Devil Man. He was pretty cool, I'm not going to lie. I watched that show. I haven't seen this one, so I'm going to have to vote him. I'm going to have to. Once we get further into the rounds, I'm going to uh, give my opinions a little more. I'm just trying to speed through this so the video's not too long. Don't know any either of these people. I've seen this show. Desperate. Was he the main character? I haven't seen Fairy Tale. It looks stupid. We're going uh <laughs> I'm pissing so many people off. Y'all supposed to like me and subscribe. What the fuck am I doing? Don't know either of these motherfuckers. His hair's kind of like mine, though. I'll vote for him. Ashito. Don't know either of these motherfuckers. He just looks annoying, though. Sailor Moon. Don't know who this girl is. Man, they just throwing words together. I don't know. Uh, Saitama versus... I don't watch sports anime, bro. We're going Saitama. You got me beat. I don't know. Goddamn. We're going Ash. You kidding me? Ash is childhood. He be picking up 500 pound Pokemon like it's nothing. He's in there bench pressing. We don't, there's something about him we don't know. He's crazy. Bro, I don't know any of these people. I know this is Digimon. I never watched Digimon. We got Goku versus Goblin Slayer. Is that his name? Generic ass name is Goblin Slayer. Goku, <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> He's probably the most iconic anime character of all time. Like everyone knows who Goku is. I don't know who this person is. I'm gonna have to go eat the Dory. Just cause he walks him down, bro. Any main character that walks you down, I gotta vote for you. I'm tired of the main character that be crying all the fucking time. I need my main character walking you the fuck down. Luffy, Ichigo, walking him fuck down, bro. I don't know. I don't. I don't know these motherfuckers. I don't know. I don't know who these are. Aaron or Mark? I have a hot take. Aaron's I. Right. Ah, here he is. This is one of my top fours, by the way. He's going far. 
Miyamoto. Y'all ever read Vag Vagabond? That shit is goaded. Change your life. Who are these people? He's got the fuckboy earrings. I have to go him. Who are these people? Tondro is another one. I hate this motherfucker. Always crying. God damn. Pick your fucking sword up. Chop a demon's head off, bitch. Stop crying. He just killed 30 people. You gonna cry after you killed him? He killed 30 more people by the time that teardrop hit the floor. He's you done. You done. Do your job. Dingy or Meliodas? This dude's a little pedo. I'm gonna have to go dingy. He just likes boobs, bro. He's just horny. We think so much alike. Who the fuck is that? Who the fuck is this? Asta. I haven't seen Black Clover either. I remember when it came out, everyone was making fun of the show. Like, it was annoying as hell. But now everyone likes it. What happened? Ah. Uh, Thorfinn. Is this that, uh... Is this that shit where they all, like, bet in high school? I don't have to go Thorfinn, though. You have no enemies. Uh, easy, Edward. The fuck? I only have to expand on that. Who are these people? Alright. One thing you will not catch me doing is voting for black, uh, what is it? This is the real Black Swordsman, by the way. It's voting for Sword Art Online. What the fuck do I look like? What the fuck, bro? I've seen him. That was a really good movie. What was the name of it? Fuck. What was the name? A Silent Voice. That, that movie's goaded. I don't know who the other dude is. Looping. Katagiri? I've heard this name before. Anime is he in? Hold up. Kata. How the fuck you spell that? Giri? Katagiri? What the fuck? Yuichi. He's got IQ apparently. What anime is this? I ain't never seen this motherfucker. What am I talking about? I'm tripping. <laughs> Jin Mori. Who are you? Who are these people? Who? Um, Gintoki. I ain't seen that show, but I seen clips of him and he looks hilarious. I should probably watch that show too. I'm gonna react to all these shows. Who are these people, bruh? This is the first hard one. It's not hard at all, actually. But. <laughs> that wasn't hard at all, but. That was the first time two good characters were against each other. What the fuck? Who? I feel like I've seen him before. But who? Light, easy. Bruh, Light and L is really not even close. L is way smarter than Light. I just rewatched the show recently. And, like, Light was... Light be fucking up so much. Just because he lets his ego get to him. I don't know any of these people, by the way. But L was on his ass the whole show. He just couldn't, like, prove it in the court of law type shit. But he knew... I don't know. Either of these motherfuckers. He just knew the whole time. 
I don't know either of these motherfuckers. <laughs> we go with Jonathan Jostar. But Light's ego would get to the best of him so bad. And just think about it. You have a death note. This magical book no one knows exists. You can write your someone's name and they just fucking die. And you get caught. I feel like I'm smarter than Light sometimes. Shit he be doing. He's supposed to be this genius kid. How do you get caught with a death note? I don't understand. Okay, we in round two, by the way. Still don't know either of these motherfuckers. Aaron or Bad Bitch, number two. Um, we're going to go Aaron, just because I don't know the other girl. <laughs> we're going to go Tenma, because I don't know who this is. Monsters go to too, by the way. If you ain't seen Monster, watch that. I don't know. These two people. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Spike or she. I don't know how to say his name. I haven't seen that show in a minute. But it's easily Spike. Come on. If y'all don't know the deeper meanings behind uh, Cowboy Bebop, that show is goaded, bro. It's so good. Don't know these people. Let's remember the. Bang! How that shit ended? Oh my god. Don't know these people. Don't know. I just know Asta. Um, yeah, I haven't read GTR. Read it. It's really good. Goku or Goku? Just off the icon alone. Alright, now this is the first hard one. Okay, okay. I can break it down some more. Nah, cuz. Okay, okay. I really like Thorfinn's character arc. That's the best thing about him. How he goes from this... This is normal kid to his revenge arc and to him coming back from that revenge arc. It's done in like a masterful way. But Lelouch, I like him in a way of he had this goal, he had this dream, and he damn near got it. But then he sacrificed himself and shit. So good. He could have. Mmm. Code Geass to me is like. If Light wasn't a fucking idiot. <laughs> that show's really good. I haven't seen it in a minute though. I'm kind of forgetting some of it. I just remember this dude being smart as fuck. And he would like. Remember that scene? Where he was like 1v1 in this other dude with these crazy abilities. And he was just outsmarting the fuck out of him. I'm gonna have to rewatch that show for real. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with Thorfinn. Just cause that character arc alone and shit. But. I don't really. I, I'm gonna vote him. I don't know the other dude is. Akira or Saitama? Okay. I'm gonna be honest. Akira? He's the main character, but he really ain't the main character, if that makes sense. I feel like the more of the focus was on his friend. I forgot his name. The one that turned evil and shit. Uh, this beat is annoying as fuck. Um, Saitama, though. We're not going to get a character like Saitama for real, ever. Because he's a whole gag character. Like, the whole point of the show is to make fun of Shonen. And it's hilarious. How he just beats all these crazy-ass enemies at one punch. It's hilarious. I'm going to go with him. Shit ain't deep. This is like... 
polar opposites right here. This is crazy. <laughs> they even look alike. What the fuck? This is like alternative timelines type shit. <laughs> Yo, who went in a fight, Ash or Kaneki? <laughs> I'm gonna have to go Kaneki though. I'm gonna have to go Kaneki. David or Sailor Moon? You know, I ain't never seen Sailor Moon. And I'm not gonna watch it. But I'm gonna go David. Fuck that. I'm gonna go, uh, I don't, I don't really remember this show, I'm not gonna lie. I remember it being good. I don't remember it. I'm gonna go Jotaro. He got the hat hair. Light or Yuji? Yu-Gi-Oh, bro. See, I like Light because he's like, he's the definition of crashing out, bro. <laughs> He got his god complex and fucking crashed out. <laughs> what do you think about the hell? <laughs> I'm gonna create a new world and I'm the god. <laughs> I'm going light. Don't know who Wang Ling is. Wang? Your name is Wang? That's crazy. I'm going Senku. Gone or Yusuke, that's actually funny because these are both made by the same dude. Let me think about it. I feel like Yusuke is just, he's so iconic and just cool, classic. But Gone, I really love what he does with his character sometimes. Like in the Khmer uh, Ant arc. How he just parallels uh, Mer Met Meruem. How Meruem goes from this evil, you know, being that's like unredeemable. And he just, you know, he finds the light. And at the end of it, you're crying for him. And then Gon goes from, you know, standard main character that can do no wrong into... He's willing to... He's crashing out. He's crashing out too. He's killing everyone. He's he's like, I will kill this innocent ass blind girl if you don't fucking do what I want type shit. I really love that. He has a bit better like writing for real than Yusuke, but Yusuke is just so iconic. <sighs> you bastard. Uh you bastard! <laughs> bastard! I don't know, bro. I don't know. Nah, this one's hard for me. Yeah. Hold up. Yo, I need to phone a friend type shit. Okay, just off the... Who do I like better? I think Yusuke is just cooler. I like him a little better. Okay, I'm going him. Even though Gon's written a little better, you know what I'm saying? But now Ichigo or Shoyu. The thing is with this show, this movie, I mean, The Silent Voice. I that shit was like so relatable at some points. It was crazy. And Ichigo is just that dude, but I ain't never seen Bleach. I'm gonna have to go Ichigo just cause it's fucking Ichigo. Like the only person that can get, like knock Ichigo out is like other goaded ass shows. So I'm gonna have to go him just off default, but I don't know any of these people. I feel like I've seen him before. I 
can't copy that. Okay. Oh, my bad. Yo. Do y'all want to start hearing some hot takes? Y'all yeah, not ready for the hot takes. All right, first of all, I'm going to glaze a little bit. I love the character arc of Edward and the, just how the show goes. He gives up all his power and all that. You know, it's, it's amazing. Naruto. Does he even have a character arc? I'm trying to remember. This character arc is just getting stronger and shit, bro. <laughs> but it's so iconic. But he's iconic too, but I, he might be more iconic. Naruto's definitely more iconic. I'm gonna have to go Naruto, but like. Let me give a hot take. I haven't seen Bleach yet, so I, I can't really. Naruto is not that well written. That's not hard to say. That's not bad. That's not really a hot take. My biggest problem with Naruto is it feels like the writer writes himself into corners. Okay? Let me cook. He writes himself into corners and he doesn't know where to go. Like, I'll give an example. Pain arc. Pain shows up, kills everybody. Crazy. It's crazy, ain't it? He just kills the whole fucking village like that. And then... The most egregious shit ever happens, in my opinion. They all get brought back to life. No balls, no gusto. You can't do that to me, bro. That just tells me you ain't got balls as a writer. You can't. Because he wrote himself in the corner. He killed everybody. He was like, wait a second. I need these people alive to finish the story. <laughs> and they all came back to life. Dog. And that's not the first time he's done this. There's multiple occasions where people die and they get brought back to life. It's almost as bad as Dragon Ball with its fucking... Oh, yeah, he, he died, but this is wishing back with the Dragon Balls. It's like on that level of writing. I'm going to have to go Naruto, though. He's just so iconic. Grew up with him. Itadori, I don't know who that fucking dude is. Luffy or this dude, Luffy, I don't know who that is. I'm going to get more into Luffy when we get to a, a real matchup. Don't know who these people are. His name is Dandy. Why did I vote for him? What the fuck what kind of name is Dandy? I'm going to go get Gintoki just because he looks hilarious. Bro, when I'm not kidding you, to me, this is the finals. Don't give a fuck about no one else on the list. This is the NBA finals. This is the Super Bowl right here. I hate to fucking do this, bro. Are you fucking with me? Listen, I'm gonna go with guts. But Miyamoto Musashi is such a philosophical journey. It, it dives deep into the mentality, to the growth of it. I love it. In my opinion, both of these. Oh my, I'm going guys. Oh my god, these are the best, like, s stories type shit. Don't know these people. Go with him, just because he made uh, Vagabond.
Baki or Denji. That's crazy matchup. I ain't for real watch Baki like that. I watched a little bit of it. I kind of got bored of it. I'm not going to lie. It wasn't even boring. They were just doing the most wild shit. I should probably watch it again. <laughs> they would just do the most wild shit in Baki. <laughs> I'll go with Denji though. He's a perv. Don't know these people. They both got red eyes. It's crazy. Boruto or I don't know who this is. Spike Spiegel. Don't know who that is. Spike is the goat, bro. Ichigo or Aaron. Is this hard for y'all? I'm going to give a hot take. Aaron is stupid. It's like he didn't think out the thought process. Do y'all know what the cycle of violence is? Aaron just created another thousand years of death. Of <laughs> his fucking actions, bro. He proved the Marlins right. Marley is right. They were basically saying, hey, y'all, y'all stay on that island because all y'all do is kill us. What Aaron do? He got off the island and immediately killed 80% of them. <laughs> they going to hate y'all for the rest of the time now. You proved them right. I'm going to eat you go. His, his mindset is just stupid. Don't know who this is. Go on, Dingy. Don't know who this is. Go on, Jotaro. Boruto, uh, easy GTO. Oh my god. Saitama or Akira Fudo? Um, I feel like he had more depth. This is what inspired Berserk, by the way. Devil Man Crybaby. It was this and, uh, what's that one thing? Fuck. He's a Omaru Mushinderu. Where that came from. Whatever the show that was called. That inspired Berserk too. But One Punch Man's a classic. I feel like this is more iconic though. I don't know. Don't know who this is. You're going light. I feel like I got some solid lists. Oh, this is tough too. Alright, let me get into the mindsets. I like Monster. I like Timba because he starts out as this, you know, he's a surgeon. He only wants to do the right thing. He only wants to save people. And then this fucking dude is trying his fucking best to break him, to make him basically like what Joker does to Batman, kill. Break his one rule, kill. The only way he's going to stop Come on, Timma. So you, you kind of see like that descent into. Uh, you see all the mora morality battles he has and shit. But Luffy is just that dude. In my opinion, Luffy is the best shonen protagonist. He fits the themes of One Piece so well, it's perfect. And my favorite part about it is, like, he starts off, go watch Fishman Island, not Island, Fishman, uh, what's it called, Along Park. When they first enter the park, how goofy they were. They didn't have no coordination. I don't even know how they fucking won. And then watch Wano, and they entered... They were a fucking team. Everyone was looking at them like, damn, this is how the Strides fight. Just the character development is crazy. He's becoming the king of the pirate. And now, when Luffy's on screen, you know he's fucking. He means business at the time. He's still goofy and shit, but like, it's, it's just different. And just that thousand episodes journey is just, it just does something to you, bro. You become a straw hat. I'm going Luffy. Thorfinn of Gintoki. Haven't seen it. I'm going to go Thorfinn. Don't know who this is. 
David. You can probably see a chin with uh, who I'm voting for. <laughs> they all down bad, sad ass characters. <laughs> uh, I'm going to eat the Dory over Senku. Don't know who this is. We're going uh, Kaneki. I don't know who this is. We're going Goku. <laughs> Naruto or Guts? In my opinion, this is damn near the easiest thing I've ever voted for. Are you kidding me? Naruto's probably more popular, but it's fucking Guts. In my opinion. Oh, well, I'll get that. I'll, I'll spoil the list. It's guts, bro. It's it's easily guts. It's easily guts. I'll get I'll get deeper into it when uh, we get there. Don't know who this is. All right, when the what's it called? The Elite Eight, Dingy or this dude? Don't know who this is for real. So I'm gonna have to go Dingy. I know he's a really good character. Y'all gonna hate me for that, but Jotaro or Light. It's kind of crazy. I'm gonna go light. I'm gonna go light. I'm gonna go light. I'm gonna go light. Do y'all want me to expand on that? Fuck you. Oh! <gasps> Spikes, Beagle, or GTO? That's actually, this is actually a crazy match, but if you think about it. Look, they both got the cigarette and everything. Damn, this is crazy. Look, listen. Because Spikes is that dude, too. He's probably more iconic. I like y'all probably don't know. You don't even know who the fuck this is. But he's definitely more iconic. More popular. But Loki. I don't know. They're both written very well. He's definitely more relatable, though, I think. I don't know. I'm going to just go Spike. Just because icon value. Mmm. I haven't seen Bleach. So, Bleach fans. I will watch Bleach. I'm going to have to go with him, though. I just haven't seen Bleach, bro. I hate to do it to y'all. Yusuke versus Guts. Damn. You bastard. I'm so sorry, Yusuke. Goodbye. David O'Connor, who had the greater trash out? I think David is the definition of trashing out. <laughs> so is him, though. <laughs> I'm going to go Kaneki. Just because this is only 10 episodes. It's a really good 10 episodes, but... It, it's only... What can you do with just 10 episodes, for real? Thorfinn eats Dory. Alright. I'm going to say my biggest complaint with JJK right now. I love JJK. It definitely should have won anime of the year. The fighting, the fights were incredible. Cinematography, incredible. The pacing is the best thing about it. The pacing is just every thing is happening. There's no downtime. It's so fun. But the pacing is a double-edged sword. That also hurts it. Since it's so fast, we don't have time to dive into the show. We don't have time to develop themes well. We don't have time to develop characters. When people were dying in season two, I did not give a fuck. His, her, his friend died. I was like, what was her name again? Don't call me crazy. My dad, I said, what was her name? She hasn't done anything in the whole season. She ain't do shit. She ain't done nothing since season one. You expect me to be sad? Play her fucking backstory. Get out of here. 
it just doesn't dive in to the themes. Characters don't seem very deep. Like it was, it, it was be deep on the surface level until you think about it. Like with him and um, Miyato, Yuji Miyato, Minato, I forget his name, but how he was like, we are the same, Yuji. You kill curses indiscriminately, like I kill humans indiscriminately. We're the same. It sounds deep at first, like damn, we are the same, until you think about it for like five seconds. Curses go into the human realm and just fucking kill innocent people. Innocent people do not go into some cursed realm and start killing curses. They just don't do that. So in a way, it's kind of self-defense killing curses. Like, you're just going to slaughter hundreds of people if I don't kill you. So I have to. It does not, it's not that deep. It's kind of stupid if you think about it. <laughs> they're, trying to, they're trying to make it deep. It's kind of stupid. So we're going with Thorfinn. <laughs> He's just way better written. Now, this right here is crazy. This icon level alone, probably the most iconic anime character of all time, is Goku. Everyone knows who Goku is. But that being said, Luffy's probably the second most iconic. It's either Goku, Luffy, or Naruto. Them are the most three. God damn. In my opinion, Luffy's better written though. And in my opinion, One Piece as a whole is better. But this isn't a One Piece list. I mean, this isn't an anime list. This is a main character list. But, okay, let's talk about the downsides of Goku. The original Dragon Ball is really good. Goku is really funny there. Okay. Saiyan Saga. Amazing. I love that saga. Okay. Goku's cool there. Frieza Saga. Super Saiyan for the first time is crazy. It's going Super Saiyan for the first time. Changed anime forever. No one was doing that until then. And then what happened after that? Oh, Cell Saga. Crazy. But that was more like Gohan made that crazy, not really Goku. Um, Boo Saga. I we got Super Saiyan 3, go uh, Vegito, Spirit Bomb, I, uh, I. and then we got GT, that was like room temperature water, okay, and then we got Super, fun with the bag with that one, besides Ultra Instinct and that uh, Goku Black arc, whereas One Piece, I ain't even got it. This show is so well written. You can deep dive on it for hours. The world building, crazy. But Luffy as a main character. He definitely fits the themes of One Piece better than Goku does. I don't know, man. I'm going Luffy. I'm going Luffy. And it's not crazy if you think about it. Light or Thorfinn? Listen. Light has one drawback in my opinion. And that is. He's not as smart. As he thinks he is. But that's kind of the point of the show. His ego gets in his way. But at the same time, they kind of built him up in the show. He's like, oh, he's this genius kid. But he just does the dumbest shit sometimes, bro. Like, his whole downfall was letting this dumbass dude control the Death Note. How you gonna let someone else... Yeah, that's... Fuck off, man, Thorfinn. Denji Kaneki. I haven't watched all of, I'm only caught up with season one of this. I haven't read the manga. 
So I'm going to go Kaneki for now. All right, Spike, Spiegel, or Luffy? I love Spike. I love his character art. But Luffy's just provided so much, bro. He's so iconic. They're both iconic. What the fuck am I saying? I don't know. It's just so hard. Y'all probably hate me right now. My gut's saying Luffy. I just love him. <laughs> this is crazy. Guts. <laughs> All right, bro. Okay. I'm going to break this down some more. My opinion. Guts is the better Thorfinn. And it also might be in Mimo to Musashi is a better Thorfinn. First off, the clips is way more traumatic than what happened to Thorfinn. The crash out of Guts is way better than what Thorfinn's was. And then the redemption arc. That farm arc was kind of crazy. It, it was better done in the manga for real than the anime. Guts' uh, redemption arc, though. It's happening slower over a, more peri a longer period of time. We haven't really seen the end of it yet. But he's finally finding the hope again. But then they fucking took it away from him again. Oh, my God. Guts, in my opinion, has the hardest fucking life at any one. But he, that's what the beauty of Berserk is. It shows the darkest, deep, darkest spots about hum humanity. But there's always a glimmer of hope. Gus has the worst life known to man. But he never gives up. That's why I love him so much. It's just like me for real. This is easy. Sorry. Alright. I love how the list ended like this. I love it. In my opinion, the King of Shonen versus the King of Sanin. And in my opinion, I love to deep dive about shit. I let the nerd out about shit. And Sanin just deep dives more into themes and dark topics that I like more. A little more mature topics. One Piece does cover mature topics. But not really in terms of Luffy. It's more in terms of the world building. They deep dive about Guts, his men, his mental state, all that shit, bro. That's why I'm going to have to go Guts, bro. I like how that ended, though. I like how that ended. That's a crazy final matchup. King of Shona versus King of Sani. That's crazy. That's crazy. Let's see how other people voted. Thorfinn won number one. See, Gus just ain't as popular as these other characters. Like, how the fuck does Goku get this high? Is this show really that popular? I don't really have to watch it. I didn't expect Lelouch to be this high either. Like, he's really good, but, like, Aaron's way too fucking high, in my opinion. I don't know who this is. I did not like him. What the fuck? Why is he so high? I did not like him, I'm not gonna lie. He's alright. He is alright. He should be higher. He's just not that popular. Whoa, where's Yusuke at? People don't like Yusuke like that. Ooh, put him near the bottom. Fuck him. Tanjiro. In my opinion, if he's not in your top three, 
What are you doing, bro? Bro, there's no way. Spike being at number 50 is insane. What the fuck? I nothing you can say about me, bro. My list was way better than whatever the fuck this is. What the fuck? Deku needs to be last. God damn, what the fuck is this list? This is horrible. You can't be in the 84 is a crime, dude. Tenma being at 86 is a crime. This is making me mad right now. What the fuck? I don't know half these people, though. <laughs> Who's in last? I gotta see. Who they got in last? She looks like she'd be in last, so I'm not mad with that. Uh, like this fucking video, dog. Oh my god, this is so long.